saw denim as like a canvas with color. So you can play with it, play different techniques, different style to create like a product that's different. I try to combine art with jeans and also like to combine with the design or like story of the jeans. There's not an actual picture of like a custom-made shop yet or like a Thai premium brand. So it's very new. Wanted to create my own brand. So you choose the fabric first. These fabric are imported from Japan. Uh, from Kaihara Mill, from Kurabo Mill. They're considered one of the best mills in the world. You can choose your leather patches. These are leather patches from Poland. Another details would be the nine stitches per inch. And the last one and the most uh, customer like would be the signature initial. For the Shino collection, I wanted to find a fabric that have other color that comes in service, which is very hard to find. I created a custom made jeans it's because I want people to express themselves, not going through trends. So like, if they like like uh, pink thread color, why not? Since I was a kid and my family, they do a OEM like jeans. So at that time I was really breathing jeans and everything is all about jeans. And when I was sleeping, I was hearing like sewing machines. It's a mindset that I was, jeans was always there. I have a dream since I was a kid. When I walk with department store, I see like a retail shop and it really interested me. I think it's very cool at that time. So it stuck to my head. So I have a mindset that, oh, one day I want a shop like this. I think they see me as a kid. It's not like they don't support, but they just say that it's not the right time yet because you don't have experience. I'm a very dreamer kind of guy. That service work was in my head like 22 hours a day for like years. There are some obstacles that I find along the way, which get me down and feeling like, is it gonna work? And at that time, Incubus just got a new album, and the song If Not Now When, it, it tells you like, yeah, if not now when. And it gives me a confidence as well. Everything was a part of me that I hate where it's coming. When he was in college, he already has this idea of like doing salvage work. We know that it's really hard because as an experience, like 20, 30 years experience in factory uh, manufacturing, it's completely different from retail. He's the only one who has this creative and artistic mind. For now, I'm really getting the results of inspiration from art and artists because now I'm also very interested in doing art. Like, uh, example, Andy Warhol, he uses colors that really show what pop art is about. So I use that as a collection and do a collection of Warhol with, with hand-painted stuff. 
I love crafting and doing stuff with, with the jeans with my own hand. I think denim and jeans can be considered a luxury item. Luxury comes from a very good quality, like going into every details of the product and really put your heart in, put your soul in. The dream would be, in the long term, I want people to really love it and see the quality of the craftsmanship and appreciate it.